Yo, what's going on guys? In this video, we're going to be doing Kira from Vault Hub. Uh, this box is rated about easy. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. Alright, so the first thing I'm going to be doing is actually just opening a uh, net discover. So I'm going to split my terminals here. Uh, let me just split them right, actually. So I'm going to split my terminals here. Uh, zoom in. So I'm going to do a net discover minus r 10.0.0.124 minus i equals 0. Here we can start our mmap scan minus sc minus sv. We'll scan all ports on the machine. So 10.0.063. Uh, we can start mmap scan on there. So we go to GoBuster. We'll start. Uh, well, actually, we don't even know if uh, port 80 is open. So we can just do a netcat minus nv. Um, I was going to do a banner grab, but we do have we do see port 80 is open. So we can just do a uh, go buster. Do, we can do a uh, dir mode minus u http minus w user share word list dir buster directory list 2.3 medium.txe. And you do see that we get uh, uploads right here. So uh, let's navigate to the IP address on uploads. So 10.0.0. Um, what was it? 63. So now we can visit our uploads. Um, right here. So I already uploaded uh, two shells right here. So right here we do have a PHP uh, reverse shell dot PHP. And the reason it wasn't accepting, or the reason I have two right here, was because it wasn't accepting uh, PHP shells, right? So I did I decided to change the extension um, right here. So. So now I, um, to the server, right, to send the right uh, extension to the server so it accepts the shell, right? So now uh, we'll split this. So if we go to actually, so if we go to language, it's actually a local file inclusion here. So if we go to language.php, uh, we can just do uh, lang is equal to three, four, five, and if we go to etc slash password, you do see that we can now view the the password, right? The password file on the password file under the etc. So what if we can do that, but just actually just visit uh, www and execute our shell, right? Since if you do go to um, 10.0.0.63, if you go to upload, or was under uploads, right? If you go to uploads, um, it's not going to let us execute. So we can just um, use a local file inclusion to actually just um, execute our shell. So we can go to uploads and then the, the file that we had was our um, PHP reverse shell.php. So um, from here we want to start a uh, netcat listener. So I'm going to start all rat netcat minus lmvp on port 8080. And we can press enter on that. So now you do see the loading symbol there. So that means we got a shell. But another cool way to do it is actually if you wanted to get a shell. Um, I mean, it takes two terminals to do this, but you can do the same thing. Um, you can just copy the URL, paste it in there, start your shell, and you can press enter. And you see it gets you the shell too. Uh, Corolla just simulates like you visiting the same website, right? Um, so from here, I'm going to start my uh, TTY shell. So we'll run this in um, bin bash and we'll run this in Python 3. So next, we're actually going to um, here, let's export term this out. Export term equals x term. Create this. So now we're actually going to go under the bar www.html ls ls minus la. And you do see that we have a D right there since um, this is a directory. And this shows a super secret, right? So we can cd into that ls. And now we do have a password, right? So we can cat into this. Um, I'm actually going to echo this on the screen. So I'm just going to echo. Um, was a hashtag? Yeah, hashtag. We can just echo this on the screen. And for the user, the way I know the user is if we go to home, 
ls. Oh, we do see that the user is sm. Um, so we've got a user, we can cd into there, and there's a, that's there, there's that user, right? So now we can switch users to, um, was it pass? Um, and for the password, it was password one, two, three. Now we're at him, right? So we can do ID. So we can Alice, uh, let's see, let's CD back into, um, home and we don't have anything here, right? So next we can just do sudo minus L. Uh, we do have his password, which was, There you go, that was his password. And we can run sudo on find command. So if we go to gtfo bins, go to find, we can run this in sudo. Press enter, we do id, now we're root. So who am I? Now I'm root, so now we can see into the root. Cat flag.txt. Flag.txt. And there is our flag um, right here just says root is better than all of them. 31337. And yeah, guys, uh, that's pretty much it in the box. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.